Okay, so one failed video attempt later, and I'm back. Um, I did a recording yesterday, but it never made it online because I was having some serious problems with my video editing software. But I'll kind of go through briefly what I did. I kind of hate when I have to do this. I know it happens. seems like it happens a lot. But um, I think I have it all sorted out now, so no worries. Um, basically what I did is I um, put in Fences, which was the new Friday update. Um, for those of you who haven't found fences yet, I'll go ahead and show you how to make them. You just put six sticks in your crafting table like this in a two by three arrangement, and um, you get two pieces of fence. A little bit of a ripoff, I guess, but considering that it's kind of a luxury item, I wouldn't worry too much about it. And I went ahead and just fenced in this area here just for fun. Kind of looks nice now. Although it still looks like a koala bear with a really bad ear infection. Anyway, um, I also found some cactuses out uh, that way someplace. And, um, yeah, I'll probably do something with those later. Anyway, it looks like I have mostly what I need to go exploring. Actually, let me go off camera for just a second and uh, make some more shovels and put some of that coal away, and I'll be right back. All right, so what I did is I put away everything that I didn't need to bring with me, and um, I brought a little coal along so I can make some extra torches if I have to. I brought some sticks along in case I need those, but whatever. Um, I made an iron pickaxe to bring, and I made a couple. I made three extra shovels to bring. Um, I already have a sword. I have plenty of stone pickaxes, so I think we're ready um, to go exploring. I think what I'm going to do is um, go and visit the pit. Because we haven't been down there in a while, and people have been uh, wanting to see some more of a place like that. Um, and there's a creeper. Interesting. I guess that's what I get for leaving my house at night. Whoa! <laughs> Holy crap. Okay. Um, it just occurred to me that I forgot to bring food. Man, I'm scatterbrained today. I just got off work. You'll have to forgive me. Um, <laughs> after a, uh, little incident like that, I think it, uh, definitely makes some sense to make some, uh, make some food. Why not go ahead and turn some of this grain into bread? Yeah, you can't pick up multiple bread at once, but... Um, since I don't have a lot of pork with me right now, um, I'll just, ah, okay. That's good. Bread is a pretty good healing method, I suppose, so we'll just go with that. And, um, yeah, I couldn't quite back away from that creeper enough in time. That was interesting. Um, thought I saw another monster over, yep, there's another creeper. Right over there. Oh! Oh my god, they're everywhere. There's like two right here in front of me, and I saw another one back in the tree line. Man, why do they keep on blowing up? Even when I get even when I back away from them. I guess what's happening is some trees and stuff are getting in my way and I'm not backing up quite as quickly as I thought. Oh my god, there's there's three over here. What's with all the creepers? Ouch. Man, they just keep on exploding. At least I got some gunpowder out of that one. Where are they all coming from, though? Jeez. Did Notch increase the radius at which they explode away from you? It seems like he did. Because I could swear that the, that the fuse would stop... Oh, by the way, another change that was made in this update, something that I've only heard about, I haven't actually seen myself yet, is uh, skeletons riding spiders. Oh, God. Skeletons riding spiders. Man, this feels like an epic battle. Ow. Really? I just died? That's ridiculous. 
Man, I was wailing on that on that skeleton. But anyway, yeah. Ow. Ow. Man, I hate these guys. They're so cheap. I'm not uploading this. Okay, seriously, since when did normal difficulty have this many enemies? I mean, there's a skeleton over there, there's a creeper, there's two zombies over there, there's a zombie right here in front of me. You saw all the monsters that I got attacked by in the last segment. I cut off the recording in kind of like a rage quit sort of fashion, but I got all my crap back. What was with all the mobs? I have never seen that many enemies attack in the night on normal difficulty. What just happened? Holy crap. Seriously. I have no words to describe how incredibly cheap that was that there were so many there's still two creepers here and I swear they blow up sooner than they used to or at least from a larger radius away from you because I used to be able to back away from them a lot better than that At least that one uncovered a little cave down here. Make a little staircase so I can get back out if I have to. Okay. Made a little cave with some coal here. But seriously, what on earth is going on here? I mean, there was an update yesterday. And yeah, there's skeletons that can ride on spiders now, and they can still attack you with their arrows while they're riding on spiders, and the spiders still jump around like crazy. They're, I've heard they're pretty cheap. I've heard that they're very, very difficult to fight. And I can imagine, because I hate spiders and I hate skeletons, I can only imagine what happens when the two of those get together. But... That was an insane amount of creepers, and then an insane amount of zombies and skeletons, and then even more creepers, and I'm just shocked right now. I don't even know what else to say besides what the F. I try to keep my videos family-friendly, guys. I, yeah, I sometimes swear in real life, but I try to keep these videos safe for uh, kids to watch. But, you know, that was just nuts. The last time I saw that many mobs at once was in InDev, when I was playing a hell level. On either, like, normal or hard difficulty. Hell levels, for those of you who don't know, could be generated in InDev, and they were basically... Mobs could spawn at any time. There was kind of a day-night cycle, but there wasn't that much of a difference between day and night. There's lava everywhere instead of water. There's lava all over the surface. Um, basically, very unhappy conditions in which to uh, in which to try to survive. Kind of uh, extra super hard mode sort of thing. Anyway. At least I got some gunpowder out of that. I might make some TNT soon. But jeez, I am so... Outstandingly... Outstanded by all of that. Anyway, I'm kind of done with this video. I'm just gonna... Upload that. Whatever that was. Being attacked by... Like, a million monsters at once. And, um... Well, I'm going to end the video with just mentioning a couple of other things that were changed in Friday's update, yesterday's update. Um, you can empty out, milk uh, empty out milk buckets now. It doesn't really do anything, um, but it's, you know, now if you have 
a bucket full of milk. It doesn't just stay full of milk and become useless. Um, let's see. There's a little swinging animation for when you activate doors and stuff with the right click button now. It used to only swing if you hit it with right click. Um, that uh, so that it kind of makes sense from your third person perspective. Um, everybody in like survival multiplayer sees like a swinging action. It just kind of makes it so that you see one too. Um, they changed the first per uh, third person perspective a little bit to where it's like directly behind the character instead of slightly off to one side now. Um, of course, there's the fences. There's the spiders being able to be ridden by skeletons. Um, trying to think of what else there were one or two other very small changes but um anyway i'm calling that the end of the video i'll catch you all later thanks for watching i can make some jolly good idols yes let's do that what the shit